couple different points. Actually, not a couple, a lot. We've got uh, information about bond calculations. These are things to memorize and be familiar with. So the bond payable credit account is a long-term liability. So when we issue the bond, we're going to have two types of entries. We've got the issuance, which I went over. That's the, the uh, cash and bonds payable. And then we've got you know the amortization and the interest as time goes on. So this is going to be cash and then bond payable. And then obviously with premium or discount. That's recorded at face value. Like I said, that's the clean number. And adjusted to represent to present the fair value of future cash outflows by subtracting unamortized discounts or adding unamortized premiums. So bond are always issued in denominations of $1,000. So it might say, we issued 10 of our $1,000 bonds, which 10 times $1,000 is $10,000. Might be bond, you know, we've got $100,000 bonds or $800,000 bonds. It'll be these clean numbers, kind of just talking about that there. Uh, the price is always quoted in hundreds, so percentage of par value. So like I said, this is going to be you know the face value times 0.97 or times 1.03. This is a discount. This is a premium. Bond indenture is a contract for the purchases of the bond. We saw that. That's the agreement. The coupon rate is a stated rate. This is just reiterating it. I really am doing my best to drill this in your mind. Uh, all of this is critically important to understand bonds before we even dive into it. Bond interest is going to be the, the coupon rate times the face, right? This is how you actually, this is what you're actually paying, right? Balance sheet. Bonds generally pay interest semi-annual in the US. However, questions can say anything. Pay attention. Yes, I agree with my statement. Uh, they will be tricky. It might say we issued at, uh, you know, we issued in January and then it's December and paid semi-annual or we paid annually. Keep in mind, right? Because if it's 8% and only half the year passed, well, that's only 4%. Super tricky, that's something to keep in mind. Uh, the principal payoff is the full face amount, and the premium or discount is the result of the buyer seller adjusting the coupon rate to the railing market rate of the interest. Again, this is going to be because you decided to give them more money or less money, uh, just you know based on the interest rate provided.